Welcome back to episode 7 of Cube Cross Skyblock. If you guys do enjoy it any point in time, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and hit that notification bell because trust me, you don't want to miss any of my future uploads. Okay, now let's get straight into this video. Okay, before we start, let's get into the brand new sub -ball members. We have four new members today. We have a uh, TBM, Harvey, Sayama, and uh, Kyle. So if you guys would like to be added to the sub in the future, all you gotta do is leave a nice friendly comment down below and be subscribed. I had four people every episode. Okay, now let's get straight into the video. Okay, so the first thing I want to do today is complete a quest that I've got off camera. Um, so it's this one. We have to travel to the desert island, so that's pretty easy. So let's do that. Okay, so we're at the cool desert island, and there's a giant baby zombie chasing me. It's not okay. I did not sign up to fight giant baby zombies. Maybe if it was a real baby, then yes, but not a giant zombie baby. Nope. I'm just going to stay over here and not attempt to do it. I'm going to be a coward. I'm not... I'm not attacking a giant zombie baby. No way. Okay, so after dying multiple times, I finally tackled the desert island. So, I'm going to go sell all the zombie parts and see how much they sell for. There we go. Wow, cactus sells for a lot as well. Uh, rotten flesh, 1 for 90. That's not bad. That's a nice easy 3k there, that's pretty good. We also have a few zombie spawners which is also really good. Probably next episode I'll make like a zombie grinder or when I get iron. Because the desert island did not give me iron. So, it's a big rip right there. I was expecting to get iron because a lot of people in my comments were saying the desert island gives you iron but apparently you're all wrong. Wow. But I did die a lot. Okay, so apparently the Never update has come out and it looks really cool, but we can't go to the Never. Great. I was not expecting there to be a quest for it, like, oh my gosh, where do you even get gold from and bones? I don't even have any of that stuff yet. So I'm probably not going to go to the Never for a while, which is pretty annoying, but it's also really cool that they have come out with such a cool update. I'm actually really excited to go to the Never. Okay, so apparently uh, dead bushes sell for so much. Uh, they're called glowstone root. Oh my gosh, one for 10,000. I could make a nice easy 130k right now. But I'm going to save them until I go to the nether because apparently they can plant in the nether. So I'm going to save them for now. Okay, so I've just planted a ton of cactus for now. Just so I can keep breaking it myself and just stockpiling on cactus for when I make an auto cactus farm. Which will hopefully be as soon as I get iron. I don't know when that is but I'm hoping it's the next island. So leave a comment down below if it is the next island because I need your help. Okay so it's about time I get my daily dose of pumpkin smashing in today. Because I've not actually smashed pumpkins in a while so let's do that. <laughs> Okay, now that we're done getting our daily dose of smashing pumpkins, I've decided to place a shop next to it so I can sell stuff quicker and quickly go to Skyblock Hub and just repair my stuff quicker, just so it's more efficient and I get to smash pumpkins more efficiently. Okay, as you can see here, I've actually got um, started on a cactus farm. So it works pretty well so far to say there's no cactus, so it doesn't work at all right now. But hopefully in the future, as soon as I get iron, I can just set it up and it works really well. So I can make quick, easy cash really easy. Okay, so I've actually added a bit of cactus to the farm and make it so it actually does start producing cactus. Just so I can sit here in AFK and just get it started so it's a lot easier. And so it doesn't waste time. So all I have to do is just sit here and collect cactus. Okay, so we've got 47 pieces of cactus on me, and I'm actually genuinely curious to see how much that would sell for. And we'd make under 10k for under a stack of cactus. Cactus is OP, and I'm not lying about this. 
Well, at least we know the title of today's video. Cactus is OP. Great title. Okay, so I actually need to sell all, all of these stuff because we've been generating a ton of chickens and feathers and that. Like, it's working really well. And I've got some really cool ideas to make it more efficient in the future, so I'm excited to do that. Again, I need iron so I can make hoppers, but I can't do that at the moment. But for now, it works pretty fine. Okay, let's sell all of this stuff. 6.7k. And 9.8k. Wow, chickens are actually really OP. And let's sell all of this stuff as well. There we go, nice 60k. Yes, please. Okay, so it was at this point in the video where I realised I needed to get my second dose of Smashing Pumpkins in. I genuinely love Smashing Pumpkins so much. And this Efficiency 3 axe, or Efficiency 4 I think it is, it's so OP for Smashing Pumpkins. I can't wait until I get an Iron Axe so I can smash even more pumpkins for longer because right now with just a Stone Axe I'll probably get like half the farm and then I have to repair it. Which is a bit annoying, but as long as I get to smash pumpkins, I'm okay. Because pumpkins are the best crops to smash. They look cool. They're literally the coolest crops and they deserve to be smashed. I don't know why, I just love to smash them. There we go. A few more rows. Okay, so it's been a few hours since I was online and my cactus farm has actually generated... Uh, 63 pieces of cactus, which is actually decent to say it's only one layer, so that's pretty cool. I can't wait until I get hoppers set up, so it's so much more efficient. But for now, I can just sit in there and climb up on the ladder, because I did build a ladder over there as well. Let me just quickly show you that. There we go. So I can just sit in here and collect it all, and then just climb up the ladder. But apparently I'm struggling. There we go. So hopefully this isn't really stupid, but... I'm thinking of buying a, another chicken spawner because recently I've been making about 40k plus from chicken spawners, maybe more. So let's see. It's 100k. Yeah, I'm going to buy one. Might as well. Hopefully this investment pays off. If not, I just waste 100k on a chicken spawner, which could be very dumb. But I think it would be very smart as like... Oh no, just more chickens and feathers because they've actually been making a ton of money recently. Plus you can just AFK and let it do it for you. And as soon as I get hoppers, it'll be even more better. But let's place these slabs over here. There we go. There. And now I can just go down below and watch an ocelot play with chickens. Very fun. Very fun indeed. Okay, so it's time for us to smash pumpkins for the third time in today's video. At this point, I should just become a pumpkin smashing channel. Leave a comment if I should do that. It's a joke, by the way. You don't actually have to leave a comment. Okay, so that chicken spawner was probably one of the best investments I've made. Because I'm generating about a stack of feathers and a stack of raw chicken per 5 minutes. Which is insane. Like, I'm probably going to make about... 70k plus per hour now which is really insane it works really well so it's a great investment so i recommend you get a ton of chicken spawners okay so my bed is pretty bouncy i think i've just had the best idea yes just stay with me do not click off the video oh gosh this is gonna be really fun best idea ever hopefully they work the exact same way as slime blocks if not, it's very dumb. There we go. We're actually pretty high up. Wow. But we do have a nice view of the base from here as well. Looks pretty cool. And here goes nothing. Oh, we died. Okay, now that was stupid. Okay, now that I'm done being stupid, I think this is where we're going to end the video off, guys. So if you guys did enjoy, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit the notification bell because trust me, you don't want to miss any of my future uploads. And yeah, join my Discord server if you haven't already. And I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.